The reality is like the telegraph and the telephone and other inventions that have become, that have come before it. The internet is being used in ways that are both good and bad. Technology is a tool. The internet is a tool. And like all tools, the good and bad uses to which it can be put are frankly limited only by people's imagination. This is true for individuals, it's true for groups, it's even true for nation states. What is also clear is that the internet does not exist in some sphere that is separate from the real world. It is being used to shape events that affect real people in real countries around the world. What that means, I believe, is clear. More than ever, the internet needs to be governed by the rule of law. Now, that's a conclusion that hasn't always been popular on the west coast of the United States or in tech companies. But I think the time has come to recognize how much things have changed. If we're going to protect people's rights in the real world, we need to protect people's rights on the internet. If we're going to keep people safe in the real world, we need to keep them safe on the internet. And while technology can play a role in protecting people's rights and keep, keeping people safe, technology cannot do all of this by itself. It requires the rule of law as well.